Hey everybody, I am ending my 10th year of doula work. It is crazy, I can hardly believe it. I like to say that the years go by fast, but the recovery from a birth marathon goes really, really slow. And I wanted to put together a little list of lessons I've learned from the 10 years. Here we go. lessons are not in any particular order, but the first one is backups are important. Now having a backup for birth doulas is really critical. There is going to be a time that you're going to need a backup and having someone that's trustworthy, that you're in communication with, and that will fill in in a way that you would want them to is really important. Right now I've got three backups and they're great and they're um, essential for my business. So setting up that relationship is very important. Now I had a really crazy, horrible situation with the backup in my earlier years. You can read more about it on the blog. The link is somewhere on the page, probably below. Um, so read about that and see what I've learned. And actually from that, I created a backup doula contract to try to get that relationship really ironed out. Now. Number two is don't ignore red flags. So red flags being what I'm talking about here is, you know, in my early days, if a client, if I interviewed with a client and they wanted me, I accepted them. Yeah, great. I wanted all the clients I could. But then I learned that maybe I'm not the right match for some of the clients that might want me. And if I see any red flags that maybe... I can sense that the relationship just isn't going to be great, that I'm really doing a disservice to my clients and myself if I accept them. Accept them. So paying attention to those red flags is really important. Number three is data matters. So by data, I mean all the information about clients and contact information and our mileage, our taxes, our um, how much money we're making, keeping track of that. I thought in the beginning that I could just keep it all in my head, which that worked for a little while until it was time for taxes and I had no idea how much mileage I drove. Um, so data is super important and I think it's the only way to grow our business is to really have a solid uh, way to manage data. Now this led me to the creation of Your Doula Biz, which is the online database management program that I use to track my own data and um, I also have available for other doulas. So more information in the links below or on the page. Okay, so number four is that repeats rock. So it takes a little while to get a repeat client because we have to wait for our first clients to end up having a second baby. But when you start having repeats, you realize that they are the best clients. You already have that relationship built. Um, it definitely saves time in the prenatal process just getting to know each other, and then you're working like just a solid team when you actually um, get to experience that second, third, or fourth birth. Um, I'm lucky enough to have supported two clients through four births, which is super exciting. And just being able to get to that uh, place in your business where I am right now, where about half of my clients are repeats. It's so awesome. So just trying to make a great experience for each client and keeping in touch with them so that they'll come back is a really great lesson learned. Number five is talk to clients about visitors. Now, if you've followed anything that I've done, uh, you've probably heard me talk about this. I talk about it a lot. I have a blog about it. I created a handout about it and I feel like I'm mentioning it all the time. So it's a super big lesson that I learned along the way. More details about my crazy visitor situation in the blog, but I will say that it's something that I cover thoroughly in prenatals. Who's going to be there and what do they know about what you want about the birth? Thanks so much for hanging in and listening to my five lessons learned. Um, I have a feeling that I'm going to have a part two because I have a few more lessons I want to get in there. Anyway, I would love to hear about the lessons that you're learning along the way. Uh, please comment either on the blog or on the video. Uh, if you like this video and you're in YouTube, go ahead and hit the subscribe button or the thumbs up. Um, that really helps you get a notification if we put another video out. And the thumbs up really helps um, it 
up the ranking so that other doulas can find this information. If you find it valuable, somebody else will too. Thanks so much. Keep up the great doula work. Bye guys.